Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, collectors of adult age, Dave here once again with a little special one today. As I record this, yesterday went to a toy slash card show, mostly card show, and uh, as you can see in front of you, I had a uh, pretty good time, got some cool shit. First up, I uh, will point out the super clean, complete box of uh, Star Trek trading cards from 1991. Excuse me. 1991 from Impel. Uh, I love it. That's going to be a fun box break rip. And I got a little thin box of 18 packs, 108 cards in all. FLIR 1995 Batman Forever trading cards. That's going to be a fun one to do. That'll be its own little video as well. And this one here. Skybox Master Series Star Trek Edition trading cards. Don't know what year this is. But that's also going to be its own little box break. Uh, Lucy, I picked up a bunch of um, Close Encounters of the Third Kind cards, movie cards, E.T. movie cards, and Superman movie cards. These are in the condition I bought them in. They're a little banged up, but I didn't have any of them, so I don't care. It's just fun to have them at all. So we're going to take a look at them briefly. I'm going to go through the Superman ones. There looks to be some sticker cards here. Looks a mix of Superman, Superman 2, Phantom Zone Villains, Otis. Yeah, that's his 1980. This uh, Superman sticker from 78. So it looks to be a mix of Superman and Superman 2. Which is fine by me. But since I'm a stickler, I'm going to separate 80 and 78. <laughs> yeah. These are cool. It's mostly Superman 2, I believe, by the looks of it. But that's all right. This one's a little banged up. These are just cool to me. I'm a big Superman movie fan. Get a look at the back of the Superman card. So retro, it hurts. <laughs> I love it. These are going to look nice all displayed in a cool folder or something. Yeah, these are fun. I'll get these all organized up into correct order and everything else. They're somewhat in order now. A couple cards missing, but they could be another stack, but I don't care. I can always hunt them down later. I'm just having a good time. Some people bag on Superman too, but I don't. I enjoyed it as a kid. I like the images chosen for these cards. Looks straight off of a piece of film stock almost. Yeah, these are awesome. Let's see, put the stickers face down. There's puzzle cards on the back of the stickers too, apparently. Yeah, these probably used to have a rubber band around them. Dinged a bunch of them. That's all right. Perry White hits the ceiling. <laughs> Love it. The bringers of hate. Space River News coughing and sneezing over there. Yeah. Like an asthmatic beaver. Thanks. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> 
That just sounded funny to me. As asthmatic beaver. <laughs> I don't know what the asterisk on the ah must mean. Uh, large portrait card. That's cool. One way to catch a buzz. <laughs> These are really fun cards. Would have been awesome to get some unopened and rip them up. But this is still cool. I love adding cool shit to my collection. That's a big win for me. Let's see, get a couple more of these cards. There's a couple random Superman 78 cards in here. Which is fun. Get a look at all of it. Christopher Reeve uh, was always Superman to me. I like other folks as the character, but I grew up with the classic. 78, 80 was a little before my time, but they are always on TV back in the day. They're always entertaining to me. And yes, I had a crush on Supergirl. Because who didn't? <laughs> a new beginning or end. So dramatic. Look at him, looking all busted up. A city in shambles. So dramatic. Okay, those are Superman 2's. And a couple from Superman 78. Whoa, that one's way off kilter there. <laughs> Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Just hitting the seven and a half minute mark, folks. We're going to take a flip through. You know what? It's Space River News. Yeah. Should I do a separate video or continue this one? You can continue. Okay. Continue this one, she says. Okay. All right. Uh, E.T. or Close Encounters, bubs? Mm, E.T. E.T. Let's take a look at the E.T. Is there also a little banged up? But I don't care because I never had any of them. Always been a fun movie, even though it's terrifying as shit as a child. Oh, All that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Looks like the sticker cards are separated to the top. Bunch of doubles. That's all right. I don't mind. If there's more than one set of things, uh, I got one for somebody else, which would be cool. Whoa, micro stickers. Cool. Almost like postage stamps those are cool there's a lot of those <laughs> look like milk carton pictures there's enough probably to come close to making that whole picture on the back of the card and framing it in full size which would be awesome air hose I really like these cards 1982 Universal City Studios Incorporated blah 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 lots of doubles lots of doubles but for five bucks I don't care did they hear you <laughs> maybe <laughs> love these cards testing the communicator 
Let's see, do they smell old? Yes, they do. <laughs> they got the 80s whip. They got 1982 DNA in these cards. That sounded gross. <laughs> Elliot's Disguise. Trouble for Elliot. Tipsy Alien. That's a good card. E.T. watching TV. Nice, nice. These are awesome. I don't care what anybody says. These are awesome. E.T. was always entertaining. Drew Barrymore. Adorable. Super hot now. You know. She's only a little bit older than me. Uh, introduction. Story of a boy's life. Blah, blah, blah. Continuing on card number two. I dig it. I'll take the best of them and save those for myself. And uh, maybe I'll make a set or a partial set for Space River News over there. What do you think, Space River? You want some ET cards? Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. I can save some in both. Yeah, sure, she says. I mean, she's going to get some. Want? Oh, I want them all. Mm -hmm. Even... Even the quadruples. <laughs> <laughs> but it's fine. I share with her because she cooks me foods. Yay! <laughs> yeah. Very fun cards. It'll give us uh, something to look for at the next card show. More cards, in pack or not, to... Uh, Possibly complete the set, which would be fun. And you look at the difference in printing there. One's super dark, one's a bit light. That's cool. We got checklist cards. We can keep track of what we got, what we don't got. Very cool. There's multiple of them, so I don't mind uh, marking one up. I dig it. Hope you guys are enjoying this video. I am. Even though I'm just rambling on and flipping through some cards here. Dip -a -dip -a -dip. Ah! You know, there's like nine cuts in that uh, yell at ET in the in the woods or the uh, shrubberies, or is it corn? I live on the edge of a cornfield or some shit randomly. Close Encounters. A quick flip through of Close Encounters cards, and then. I'm going to probably shut it down. Maybe take a nap. Definitely drink something. And, uh... I don't know. <laughs> uh, seminal work of science fiction. 1978. These are straight sticker cards. Nothing on the back of them. I wonder how many of these cards just got straight ripped up back in the day. My greedy little grubby kids and peeling them all off and shit. Probably would have been me when I was young. What's another movie I didn't quite understand or get or necessarily enjoy back in the day. But I absolutely love it once I started to understand it. Concept artist concepts man some of these cards are way off center cut Yeah well, That's why multiples are fun You get to choose the ones that you like the best and uh, Pass off the shitty ones <laughs> <laughs> Both of them
Today is the last day we gain sunlight. Folks, it only means one thing. Winter is coming. <laughs> Jesus. Those people in Minnesota. Shut up, people in Win Minnesota. Winter is not coming. <laughs> At the rate uh, George R. R. Martin um, writes, winter is never coming. <laughs> Ooh, this one's got a wicked gross sticker smudge or tape smudge on that one. Well, that's all right. Linda Dillon. I like how they got the actor's name and the character name on there. That's neat. I dig that. More cards should do that. Get a little info on the front and right up on the back. A lot of large images built into the back of these cards. So that'll be fun trying to build it up. And you can probably hear the trash guy out back. Hey, anybody want to sponsor a trip to uh, Devil's Tower? Yeah. Give me a few thousand dollars and uh, a directive to go to uh, Wyoming. I'll go visit. Especially if you pay for it. I'll go damn near anywhere in the continental United States if somebody else wants to pay for it. There's so much. These cards are so cool. I love it. Having so much fun glancing at these things. Makes me want to watch the movie, yo. Wow, some of these are wicked off cut. Like that one. Wow. Ooh, and that one. Good God, man. Might be fun to keep a collection of just off cut cards. Jesus. That is terrible. Well, who cared back in the day, right? They're cheap as shit. You can get enough of them, you'll find uh, enough nice cards and get a good set. Jillian at Devil's Tower. Nice card. Notice a lot of the kid, a lot of the female, a lot of the aliens. I haven't seen Richard Dreyfus. Maybe all the Richard Dreyfus cards either don't exist or were taken out by uh, somebody along the way. Here's a few more sticker cards. I'm going to have to do a little research on the set. And see if there were Richard Dreyfus cards that uh, were taken out. If that's my suspicion at this point. What do you think, Space River News? You think all the Richard Dreyfus cards either don't exist or were taken out of the set? Hmm. I don't know, maybe they don't exist there. It took me a second to realize it, but I have not seen him yet, and I'm. Uh, about halfway through this uh, double stack of cards here. Yeah. Lots of the kids, lots of the females. Mm -hmm. Haven't seen a single Richard Dreyfus. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think Is they were. The ET or the. The Close Encounters. Close Encounters yeah. I think somebody along the way took out all the. Richard Dreyfus cards. Well, looks like I'm going to have to find some more of these cards to complete a set then. No big rush, but I need more. I need more. Give me more. I need my fix. <laughs> there are some really cool images chosen here. Now this card, I love this card. Great image. And wicked off cut. Wow, I love it. I had to keep all those just for randomness, yo. K 
kids in spacesuits, little alien dudes, boys and girls in space alien outfits. Yeah. Very cool cards. Yep, definitely got to go to Devil's Tower. Somebody sponsor Dave's Empire's trip to Devil's Tower, Wyoming. I'm going to need a couple thousand dollars for gas. Well, maybe like a couple extra thousand dollars for gas. Because, you know, gas prices. Uh, about a thousand for a hotel and uh, let's go to a couple hundred for food. Yeah, how about that? Sponsor me! Sponsor me to Devil's Tower! Ah! Okay, I'm done. <laughs> that was my little uh, flip through the cards I picked up at the card show. Stay tuned at some point soon for some sweet box breaks. Peace.